That's me, your boy Eddie Wong in the headphones. My family was moving from Washington, D.C. to Orlando, Florida. I was 11 years old, and it was 1995. This is the story of my family, an American family, the Wongs. That's my dad. He loved everything about America. Full on bought into the American dream. Moms was always hard on me, way before all that Tiger Mom stuff. She thought I was trying to cause trouble wearing that Nas shirt, but she didn't understand. If you were an outsider, hip hop was your anthem. And I was definitely the black sheep in my family. These other people are Emory, Evan, and Grandma, whatever. Was I excited about the move? No. Did anyone ask me if I was excited? Hell no. But it's hard getting respect when you're 11. I saw the sign, and it opened up my eyes. I saw the sign. Um, Dad, the turn man. off the music. Eddie, I know you're not excited to leave. OK, I was talking to you. Why do all your shirts have black men on them? It's Notorious B.I.G. Me and him are both dudes with mad dreams, just trying to get a little bit of respect in the game. Just trying to get a nut. Jessica, I figured it out. Dad, how come we have to start school on a Wednesday? That's a great question. Go to school. Go, 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 go. Yeah. So, cool if I sit? No. Fine, but don't try to talk to me. I don't like kids. My best friend is a 40-year-old man. Yo. Yo, Chinese kid. What's your name again? Something Chinese. My name's Eddie. Eddie. You into B.I.G.? Yeah, man. He's sick. I bought Ready to Die the day it came out. You bought it? I stole it. <laughs> Yo, come sit with us. Yeah? OK, man, cool. A white dude and an Asian dude bonding over a black dude. This cafeteria is ridiculous. So, I'm Eddie. So, hey, dude. Hey, what's up, up, man? So my cousin told me about B.I.G. when I went to visit him last summer, and he, oh, what is that? Gross! It's Chinese food. My mom makes it. Get it out of here. Oh, my God. Ying Ming's eating worms. <laughs> go, go, oh, get that out of here. Go. Dude, that smells nasty. <laughs> oh, it didn't go well. The white people didn't welcome you with open arms. What? Sit elsewhere, B.I.G. When you live in a Lunchables world, it's not always easy being homemade Chinese food. But it's also what makes you special. My family was gonna create their place in Orlando, and we're gonna do it our way. Because you don't have to pretend to be someone else in order to belong. Yeah, son. Little bit of respect. Like B.I.G. said, if you don't know, now you know. Baby, baby. Uh.